So what is a sea urchin? A sea urchin is part of a, phy a phylum called uh, echinoderms. And in this phylum, sea urchins are related to sea cucumbers, sea stars, also crinoids. And what gives sea urchins their name is, if you break down their name, it means spiny skin. And if you take a sea urchin, you'll notice that it has all these spines um, that is very characteristic of what a sea urchin is, that they have spiny skin. And in Puerto Rico, we have seven species of sea urchins. Uh, this species is uh, known as the West Indian sea egg, also known as Trip Tripnustes ventricostas. Uh, what is special about sea urchins, um, they can be found in temperate to all the way to polar regions to tropical environments from very shallow waters to very, very deep waters, um, greater than 5,000 meters. Um, but they are very unique because they don't have blood, but they have a unique water vascular system that helps with gas exchange and nutrients, but also helps them move. Uh, they don't have arm and feet, but they have these appendages called two feet. And with the water vascular system, they use seawater to help move these two feet um, in and out of the urchins' bodies. And that helps them also grab onto things like seaweed or a reef. What is also very unique of sea urchins and helps them uh, graze at the substrate is that they have a mouth. Uh, so if you flip an urchin over, you will notice that there's a small little hole. And in this mouth, it contains a very unique apparatus called Aristotle's lantern which means that they have these five really sharp and strong teeth. So they are able to rasp at the substrate to, to remove that algae. Um, and that's what makes them very, very efficient grazers on coral reefs.